Oh, I'm online right now. You are ready. Okay, I guess I'll give people a couple minutes to get on. I'm very excited. The live button. Yes. Hi, Nia, 1214. Hi, Alex and Dreda, 007. The fabulous Deja Vu. Kavare, Sheila Posey. Hey, Miss. Is it Mr. Speed? Oh, Mrs. Peen. Oh, that's a cute name. Brown Skin Beauty. Traveling Goddess. Faith Jefferson 8. Marion Brooks. Trinity. Image Nails. Hey, I'm going to need you real quick, fast, and in a hurry. Cause <laughs> Hello from Greensboro, North Carolina. Hey, boo boo. Entire World Travel. Hello, everyone. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to our uh, Sister Circle Live behind. The screen. <laughs> I don't know, I just made that up myself. So today, I'm going to have my friend Tamika Scott join us today. We're going to talk about friendship. We're going to talk quarantine. We're going to talk, uh, hey, Rashawn Ali, hey. Um, we're just going to talk everything behind the scenes. And we're going to have a great time. I feel like a, I feel like, um, a secretary today. Do I look like a secretary? I thought I would try something new. Thank you, Tiana. She has a cute shirt. Hey, Bowie State Bits, you. What up, P. Diddy, 213. Um, watching from Cartersville, Georgia. I don't know where that is, but hello. Um, Kelly knows nursing. Hey, Kelly knows nursing. How are things going with the corona where you are? And have Tamika Scott just logged in. Hey, Tamika. Tamika Scott. Okay, so while we wait for Tamika to log on, um, I just want you guys to uh, jump in with your questions and, and I want you to tell me uh, how you've been handling uh, the coronavirus and the social distancing and what you've been doing with your personal time. Uh, we'll do that during uh, question and answer time and comment time. Um, what else? Uh, so, okay, because you guys know me and you guys know that I'm, I'm slightly, hey, Arena TLC, Nikki Marie Radio, how's life for me? Life is pretty okay. Hey, to, all right, pretty girl to me. Hi, Tree Tree. Good morning. How are you, baby? I'm good. Turn around. Turn around. Look to your left. I'm waving. You see me waving out the window? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to back up so you guys can see my face a little bit more. Is that better? Can you post my face a little bit more? Hey, Tamika. Yes, I see you. <laughs> Hi, beautiful. I think I was supposed to wear, I was supposed to wear my earbuds and I forgot. It's okay. I will be okay. <laughs> okay. So, Tamika, even though we live very close together, we cannot see each other. Two houses, three houses down from each other. We are three houses down from each other. Amazing. So, how, how have you been corona quarantining? Well, you know, I've been here with my family, cooking, just trying different little recipes. And I'm, I am doing um, teaching now, homeschool teaching. <laughs> but I'm ready. And I feel after, you know, I'm raising my hand. I feel like teachers, all teachers should get a raise yes. when they go back to school. Because I only have one now. And it's, it's been like a challenge for me. Somebody pray for me, please. Because that's not one of my talents. God bless me to sing. But teaching isn't one of my talents. Girl. Well, what else have you been doing? I'm telling you, with this whole corona thing and... You know, trying to teach your kids, it's like you have to relearn things all over again. So, you know, my heart goes out to the teachers, you know, um, out to the teachers who have more than just one. They have 30 of our children to teach. So shout out to all the teachers for everything you guys do. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. My kids are not schooling anymore. Thank you, each and every teacher, for what you do. Thank you. Kids can go get my rings. I got my rings. But Tamika, we're just going to jump into asking you a whole bunch of questions as if we know each other, but, we, but the good people don't know. So, uh, were you able to find anything positive out of, of all of this corona quarantining? So, tell me what your funniest story so far. Well, I think the best thing about this is my kids are constantly washing their hands. When it's time to clean up, I don't have to clean up by myself anymore. Young Naya did the dishes the other day. Um, our money helped me wipe down the light switches with Clorox, the stair, the staircasing. 
Everyone in my house is extra clean. Yes. So that's a positive out of everything. My house ain't been this clean in a long time. Everybody cleaning up, even the dog. The, the, <laughs> <laughs> can you raise your camera? Oh, somebody said, can I raise the camera? Because my head is chopped off. I love it. Your morning coffee, I love it. I just had my morning coffee as well. Yeah, well, that's Coca the morning Coca Cola. Okay. I, I took on a bad habit of soda, and I don't drink. So you know, I don't drink soda. No, you don't. I, I did this one. I need a little caffeine boost after my Nutra burst. <laughs> Um, so, um, do you have any meaning for the word Frisbee family since you've been quarantined? Well, I mean, I've always been close to my family. I've always been close to my friends. So this, it really, nothing has really changed because when I'm out on the road with Escape, I am home with my family. You know, family is very important to me. Good friendship is very important to me. So now it's giving me a chance to really just have that one-on-one -on -one time with each child, with my husband. So it's I, it's it's been wonderful. I've been I've been having a great time. It's crazy because when I was watching the news the other day, they were saying that divorce rate is at its all time high, and I was like, what? No. People haven't even been in the house more than two weeks with their significant others or their spouses. But it has definitely been a, been a blessing for me. Well, some some people don't want to spend two weeks with their spouses. <laughs> they look forward to going to work so they can have that time. Out. I mean, it was so many different outlets. Sports, they've taken away sports. They've taken away the gym. Like, th think about the outlets that people have to go and release stress. Now you have to just sit there and face the person you said, I do. Look, I do. <laughs> I was thinking more people would stay together, honey. Love, clothes, yeah. you know. Um, I, I'm having a good time. But someone asked, um, hey, can, hey, Chef Cam, he's a really great friend of Sister Circle. Um, guys, of course, be sure to watch today at 12 o'clock on TV One. We will have the Hamiltons on there. And of course, we're going to have, uh, we have a morning save with Summer Jackson on there as well. And someone on my skin. You like that? You know what? I use this. Um, I'll, I'll show you guys the products before, before I leave. So, I'm not trying to do infomercial. I'm just trying to hey, hey, bring, bring some over. Bring some over two, three houses down. Bring me some of that product because I need that product as well. I'll put it in the mailbox. I love you, but you know, I'm, I'm Trina, going to eat. don't front. Do not front because you lie. Let me tell you. The other day, I was barbecuing. I get a call from Tree Tree, and she's like, what are you doing? I, I just put something in your mailbox. I said, I'm, I'm in the back barbecuing. So her and Mr. Von Scales came around to the back, and we had conversations. They came in the house. We had a good time, a good old time, just sitting, talking, reminiscing. We were dancing and just enjoying ourselves. So she could sit here in front like she ain't seen nobody. She's been to my house, y'all. Because Von and I went on a walk, and then, you know, we put something in their mailbox, and I called, and I said, oh, we, we just dropped something in your mailbox. So, oh, oh thank you, Mr. Tech. And she was like, wait a minute. Come back, come back. We're barbecuing outside. So we ended up barbecuing. And had a good time. I, look, we just, I just ate food. So, <laughs> uh, speaking of uh, spending time together, you have a new uh, record called um, Family Affair. Yes. Tell us about it. Bam. <gasps> Family. <laughs> Family Affair is my new EP. And I named it Family Affair because, like I said earlier, my family is like my everything. Mm -hmm. And with this EP, it's, a, it's about my life. It's about certain situations that I, I had to overcome. And mm -hmm. my family, I have very talented kids. Young Naya, we call her the Princess of the South. She's, she's rapping on one of the songs, my oldest, Ocean. If anybody can remember, I was pregnant when I was in the group Escape. Love on my mind video. I was pregnant with Ocean. She's singing on one of the songs. My husband, he's getting his Kurt Franklin on, on my inspirational song. And you can hear Princess Our Money in the background of one of the songs. So I titled it Family Affair because it's all about my family and it's about my life, things that I had to overcome. Okay, well, let's talk about, it's, it's raining outside, but let's talk about your single, 
go outside in the rain. Yes, go outside in the rain. That was a remake of Malira. Malira did that song in 1990, and my group escaped. We would sing that song at talent shows, and we would win at talent shows. So I, I wanted to pay homage to her, so I put it on this on my EP. And when doing the video, I wanted to be authentic. So okay. if you see the video, all of my best friends, all of my good friends are in the video. Trina starts it all. Yes. <laughs> you and Patrice, y'all started off in my high school best friends. They're real. Those are my real friends that were in the video. And it's about a heartbreak. It's about being in pain. You're in so much pain that you want to go outside in the rain so people won't see the tears coming out your face. You want to disguise that pain with the rain. So it talks about the heartache, that the pain of the breakup that you that you uh, face in different relationships. Ooh. Well, you were talking about uh, Young Naya. Young Naya. Yes, and I just saw her uh, video the other day called No Chorus. <laughs> Yes. Hey, Johnson, and she was just wrapping it up, doing a great, great, great job as she always does. Uh, Thank so you. About your influence on on Naya's career, and talk to us about your acting career. We were just gonna play together. <laughs> so let, let let let's get all that good stuff in. Well, young Naya, she's one of the she's a lyricist. I started my label, Brolic Entertainment, because she always says she wanted to do music. So I started my label so I can help her along the way. I give I give a hundred percent. She's been she's been doing a lot of things. Uh she opened up for us, escape on tour. Uh, she has yes. Um her stage presence is 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 beautiful. She auditioned for a series that she has. So she, she auditioned for the very first time and she got it. So I'm excited about that. And you know Escape, we're doing our biopic. Mm -hmm. So uh <clears throat> she may be Playing me, I don't you know, can't talk about it right now. But what? you know, might be playing her mama, and if she do play me, she's gonna have a crazy role to play because her mama was crazy back back when I was with the group. That's dope. <laughs> That's real dope. Uh, let me see. Um, talk to me about your acting career. Though. Are you still trying to act? What you trying to do? Well, right now I just finished writing the series. I want to be behind the camera. I want to give other talented people a chance to be seen. So I am finishing a series right now, and I'll be having everything on my website, TamikaScott.com. Make sure you follow TamikaScott.com to keep up with when we're having auditions or, and other things that's involved with it. Well, let me ask you a question. <laughs> on a real personal note, you know, uh -oh. we both know that it's really difficult. Hey, the Alexa Beauty, uh, we both know that it's really difficult <laughs> in this industry, especially if you have friends uh, for 20 years like we have been. Talk to people about being in this industry and having real true friends in this industry. True friends, first of all, true friends are hard to find. So if you find that good friend, you hold on to that person. I think the honest, being being able to be honest with each other is great. You know, like if something is going on, Trina will call me or I have other best friends that will call me and be like, uh, you shouldn't have said that or you shouldn't have done that. You can't, if you don't have anyone around you that's telling you when you're wrong, praising you when you're right, then you need a new circle of friends. Honesty is the, is the biggest key of a friendship. Loyalty. You have yeah. to be loyal, very loyal to a friend. And don't mm -hmm. just look for the loyalty from them. You have to give loyalty as well. Um, yeah. What you think? Yeah. Hey, come on, help me with these ingredients, boo. <laughs> well, I, I think it's that, especially in our relationship, we have people that tell you when you're wrong. Instead of just telling you when you're right all the time. And that's the one thing I love about our friendship. We can be like, uh, Trina, you wrong. I can be like, Nick, I don't know. I done that. You know, but it takes a friendship to be able to talk to each other that way. And that takes time. You know what I mean? Honesty takes time. Because sometimes you don't have to react, how they're not going to react. Um, and some people just can't take it. You can't handle the truth. You know what I mean? <laughs> I watched the uh, Office of the Gentleman yesterday. I'm sorry. So, um. Hey, Cooker McCann. Hey, Selena Johnson. Um, but I think I think true friendship is about being truthful to each other. I think that's what it's, what it's honestly about. And I'm going to answer somebody's question, but they asked me about my skin. And this is not a sales pitch because I'm not getting no money. But um, I use this on the air line. I use um, the face wash. And this is like a night cream, a face cream, and an eye cream. I mix all three of these together. And then I take the pill. 
It has glutathione in it. And glutathione is like a beautiful blender and toner for your face. And that's why it's so smooth and creamy. And that's that's real friendship there. Because some people don't like to give away their secrets. Some people don't they want to give you their secrets to what they're doing. So if you got a friend that's open to telling you what makes her face glow, you got you a good friend, baby. Yeah, um, and these are friends of mine. So, uh, Emerald Amer and Dr. Lenny Lomax. They gave me these products to try, and they turned out to be amazing. So I use it every day. All right. Beautiful. <laughs> Where's Mr. Von Scales? Where's Mr. Von Scales right now? Von Scales? I don't know. Mr. This is not Von's interview. So he's so <laughs> he is not a part of my show, and I'm not a part of his business. I have a worse in this world. Hey, Von. If you're watching, hi. Hey, I'll tell, I will tell him that you say hi. My mother's sitting up here in the corner. She, hey, Miss Eames. He says, say hi. You don't have to get in the picture to say hi so they can hear you. Hi! Do I hear mommy? She said hi. <laughs> Someone asked me if we've been friends. He and I have been friends for 20 years. And we still together. So That's right. Hey, baby. Hey, fun. <laughs> hey. And speaking of watching, you guys, don't forget TV One, 12 o'clock today. Uh, with Sister Circle, we're going to have the Hamiltons on there. We're going to do our Sister Circle ratings. A little bit of politics going on in there. So you guys still do not want to miss it. It could be a show that you can that you've missed. And of course, we come on again at 3 o'clock on Cleo. And not to what's happening on Cleo today with Sister Circle. Talk to us about... Uh, the live that you're doing with Naya and um, and Haley today. So I have a live at three o'clock today with young Naya and another beautiful artist named Haley House. Uh, she has a new song out called Anxiety. And I sat mm -hmm. and I listened to the words and it was the words brought tears to my eyes, not knowing that, you know, our younger generation, the things that they go through. Sometimes it's hard to see when someone is going to, when someone has depression or anxiety. So I wanted to give them that platform to speak about it. And, and to figure out ways to get through it. So we're going live on my IG, The Real Tamika Scott, today at 3 o'clock. So if you know anyone that's suffering anxiety or depression, um, make sure you join live so you can hear from the younger generation of how they're dealing with it. Oh, some, somebody said the sound is not good on my end. I think because I pushed it back some more. I'm not going to Hey, Marlena. Marlena's one of our neighbors, too. Yes. Yeah, she's down the street. Uh, so we're going to go to the questions. And Mr. Tay is going to help me because I can't push the button ever. He said he pushed the button for me. Uh, uh. Did it, okay. Oh, somebody asked me, can I follow them back on Instagram? Yes, I'll follow you right back. Cooking daily, three squares a day. is blessed. Okay. Somebody said, how did you and Tamika... Yes. And we were both working with Jermaine Dupri at the same time. It's like when we met, it was like we had known each other forever. You know, when we met, it was like I was meeting my, my long lost sister. Yeah. And we just jailed. We jailed. We were acting silly. Back then, we were so much younger, so we were so much sillier. But the love, was, you just feel the love just talking to you. You just made me feel so comfortable. I felt like I could trust you. So we just formed that, that friendship, that bond, unbreakable bond. I love you, girl. I love you, too. <laughs> Tamika, what did someone ask? What, no, no, some, no, that's somebody else. Somebody asked about Tamika's skin. Tamika, what, what is your skincare and beauty tips? Girl, I need to be doing what Trina's doing. Okay, <laughs> don't laugh at me. Okay, don't laugh at me. I use Noxzema. I'm a Noxzema baby. I, I grew up on Noxzema and I use Noxzema. So there you go. That's old school. Old school. Old school. Somebody said, Trina, can make cocktails again? Okay. It is 11.49 a.m., boo, and um, I won't be doing that this morning, but I'm going to tell you what I am going to do. I'm going to start doing a happy hour at 4 o'clock, 
and I'm just gonna make drinks so we can all sit and talk and do like this open forum and we can just all sit and talk. I'm gonna do it on my personal page. I'll talk about that later. Back to my own page. Right now, this is Sister Circle TV. And we'll be done in 10 minutes on TV One. We'll have the Hamiltons on there and our uh, Sister Circle savings. We're gonna be talking about politics. And you guys, please, please, please tune in at 12 and at on TV One and Cleo TV. Okay. Damn, that's all you need. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to school with Noxima. Girl, I saw on TV the other day somebody was talking about Tussie. Y'all remember Tussie? Girl. Yes. The roll on, the little red, it was red and white, the little roll on Tussie. Or the cream, that the little cream. Y'all remember oh. Tussie? Yeah, I remember Tussie. I thought it was a roll on. That was long. girl. I was I was in middle school. It was the cream. You still you the Tussie? <laughs> I, I thought they still made it Tussie. I don't know. I don't know. When is Braxton Family Value back? That's a good question. During this time of social distancing, <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> it is slated to come back, but I have no idea when. Hey, Ayana Reese. <laughs> Uh, Tamika, this question is for you. Tamika, will there be an Escape 4 tour again? Yes. Um, before everything happened, we were, we were uh, all four of us Escape, are doing a sh we were doing a show here in Atlanta. We have more shows coming. So once everything calms down, you'll be able to see Escape, Escape 3, and you'll be able to see me. Okay. And speaking of Escape, Tamika, when is the, when is the, when is the Escape movie coming out? Girl, let me tell you. It's, it's, it's a lot of stuff going on. You have four bosses with four different stories. Some of us have gotten older. Some people forgot some of the way the story went. I ain't going to say no names, but. <laughs> so we just trying to, we, we, we have to get everything together so we can give y'all the best. Because there's so many crazy things that happen in our career. But we want to be able to give y'all the most interesting things. So it's coming. It is coming. Okay. Definitely. Another question is, do you guys have any fitness tips? Hmm. I just say keep it cute and put it on mute. Whatever. <laughs> I need to do better in that department. I really do. <laughs> I do. <laughs> Don't talk about me. Pray for me. Then we're going to pray for each other. We're going to pray for each other. Okay? Shoot. Oh my gosh, Chef Cam is on one today. What is going on? Okay. Oh, 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 do you have any academic advice, Trina, for those in slash college? Academic advice. Let me tell you, before I go down to the advice, when I was younger and going to school, um, I was still on and going to school at the same time. And had then what I know now, I would have still continued on with school while I was born. Topic. So my thing is academia is something that no one can do. And that is the one thing that you say, oh, what do I have my degree, I have my doctorate. Yep, you sure do for the whole rest of your life. And could that education is something no one can do from you. So the more you educate yourself, the better you are to put yourself in what's going on in the world today. Education is knowledge and key. What's your recommendations for saving money during this time? Stay at home. And set up Amazon. <laughs> That's all you can do. And Groupon. Stay off of, uh, what, what's the other stuff that's on there? I just know Amazon and Groupon. And also they have different programs. If, say for instance, for mortgage, um, car notes, you can call the company that you're with and see can they defer some of the payments to say, okay, for the to, for the next two to three months, you know, could I not pay? Call them and talk to them because everybody knows what's going on at this time. There, are, there are different companies that will allow you not to pay or skip a couple of months until okay, the country goes back. Forbearance, mm -hmm. like forbearance. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And they just back it on to the end. And you don't have to worry about it. Right. Oh, I like that. I love your hair, Trina. Oh, thank you, Jacob. Thank you. You know, it takes me a while to do it, man, but I'm getting used to it. <laughs> Amazon is price gouging. Why did I have to have a good old time? I just need to skip a carpet. <laughs> Don't we all need to skip a carpet? So, yeah, so make sure you call. I mean, call them and let them know. You'll be surprised. 
what they'll say. They may say four months. They may say five months you don't have to pay. But at least call. Reach out and call. Don't be afraid. Like running from bill collectors, don't do it. Call them and let them know your situation. You'll be surprised. All right, so tell you, you heard that. <laughs> the mortgage payments and them car payments and them boat payments. So, <laughs> all right, guys, we're about five minutes away from Sister Circle Live at 12 o'clock on TV1. Uh, you can also check your local listings, listings depending on where you are. You don't free, Clio TV also does uh, Sister Circle. And we're also going to do at 3 o'clock today, Tamika and Young Naya and Haley Heiss is going to be talking about mental health. And uh, I will be doing a live happy hour at around 4 o'clock, but we'll talk about that on my personal page. Andrea Harris said that her auto loan did this. Yes, you can. You have to be affected by COVID-19. I don't know what that means. Um, I mean, you have to have the COVID or uh, what, what, more research before we give you guys that type of information because I don't know. So, so about the car payment and mortgage, it might be different. What the mortgage company said, my mortgage was a thousand. Furry for what's I don't know what a is. The third month you have to come with all three payments. What? Like in one big sum? Like I said, do your research and see what's going on with your personal mortgage company or your car company, whatever the case may be. Um, Michelle, uh, I'll let you know about the time on my personal page. I'll do a, a, a pre what's going on kind of thing. Okay, someone said maybe COVID, no loss of pay due to COVID. Um, and someone said, I think we're all affected to some degree. Yeah, because I mean, I don't understand how they would know whether or not you get protected. I, I, don't, I don't know. I'm not trying to say, um, try to ride the system. But what I, am saying, what I am saying is do your homework and find out what you can do to help you to save money during this. Oh, and while we're here, I would like to say, please do not neglect your local food banks. If you're going to the store, pick up an extra can, pick up an extra box, pick up an extra couple of boxes of non-perishable goods because there are some things that are really, really in need of help and cannot afford uh, going to the store or uh, and even toilet paper uh, and this is not even a joke toilet paper paper towels they need these things as well so please don't try to afford it for yourself because there are really truly some people in need so please do not forget your local food pantries i just want to put that out there yes every company is different we're about four minutes away from sister circle on tv one we have a few more questions. We're thanking Ms. Tamika Scott right now for being on with us. And we are going to ask just a few more questions. But before we do that, Tree Tree, yep. let me encourage everyone to please go get my EP, Family Affair. It debuted in the top 10 on iTunes and Apple Music. It came in number three on Amazon.com. It is real, it is great R&B singing, great R&B music. So download, stream, Spotify, Pandora, Apple Music, support your girl in my in my movement. That's Thank right. you so much for all your support with my group Escape, with us individually, collectively. We thank y'all. We're nothing without y'all. And we want to tell you we love you. We thank you so much. And Sybil, Sybil asked us both about our hair routine. You don't want to talk about your hair routine to me? Girl, I wear so much weed. I may have braids today. I may have a ponytail tomorrow. I'm the weave queen. I love <laughs> stiff wear. Stiff wear. I love, <laughs> I love hair. I just I just started doing, I tried this product. It's called Hawaiian Silky. You know, like it's the spray little thing. I just wash my hair and I just spray it on there and I keep it moving. And then, of course, I wash my face on Miara and make sure you guys go over there and I have a whole bunch of products I'm put on my personal page. But someone, listen, our last question before we leave. And what was uh, someone is asking to make a hey call me? What was your most memorable moment working on Meet the Browns together? What was your most memorable moment working with me? Um, I don't know. We have a lot of moments. We Let did. me see. <laughs> we had a lot of moments. But you know what? We were roommates. Yes, we were roommates. We were roommates. Sure. We shared rooms on the whole tour. Sure did. Sure did. And yes, I agree that Meet the Browns was, was, was Tyler Perry's best play because Tamika and I were on it. And of course, um, Tamala and David Mann made it a wonderful experience for us. And I hate to say it, but it's just the truth. I got Tamika her first drink while we were on tour. She did. She sure did. It was I turned 30 and she took me to get my first drink when I turned 30. Mm. Yeah. 
So we're not going to say how long ago that was, right, me? Yeah, that was a long time ago. <laughs> Before uh, we get to Sister Circle TV on TV1, we're going to let you guys go. The television's on to TV1 and watch Sister Circle. We're going to have our Sister Circle savings and, of course, have the Hamiltons. Put some respect on it. And, and uh, if I you want to... Hey! <laughs> you want to keep up? Tamika, say goodbye to the good people. I want to say, if you want to keep up with me, you can follow me on IG, The Real Tamika Scott, on YouTube. Make sure you subscribe, because I'm giving you my little recipes. The Real Tamika Scott. Facebook, Tamika Scott. TamikaScott.com. Keep up with me. I answer my DMs. I do interact with my fans. And I love you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you, Tree Tree. It's yeah. the circle. Of course, and of course, guys, follow Sister Circle TV, Tipping the Underscore Scales, Trina Braxton One, Rashan Ali, Selena Johnson, and of course, Absolutely Quad. We will see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.